Hello and welcome, my name is Zane and this is my short guide to birdhouse runs. So let's get right into it. The requirements for this method are that you need to have completed the Bon Voyage quest. You also need a minimum of 5 crafting and 5 hunters to do this method, although obviously higher levels in both of those skills does help to improve your results. And on to the preparations, now there's a few things you need to do. The first one is to unlock the teleport to the house on the hill on your dig site pendant. You do this simply by running through Fossil Island to the house on the hill which you can see on the map. When you're inside of there, as you can see on the screen, there is a book. You want to use your dig site pendant on the book and it will give you the option to teleport to the house on the hill. The next preparation that you will need to do is unlock the magical mushroom teleportation system. One of these is in the house on the hill and you can unlock that while you're there. And the two others you'll need to unlock for this method are the Verdant Valley and the Mushroom Meadow ones. And on the screen now, I will show you a quick sample of what each of those will look like when you're in the area. As for the third preparation, you need to decide what birdhouse you're going to make and use. So on the screen now, there is a table pulled from the RS wiki, which shows you the crafting requirements and the hunter requirements for using each of these birdhouses. So choose the one that you can actually use and preferably also make. And you have two options here, you can either buy them from the Grand Exchange, which I don't recommend, it's rather pointless, or you can make them yourselves. You'll only need four of them ever. When you come to replace the birdhouses on your runs, what you'll notice is you actually keep the clockworks, so on each run you'll only ever need to replace the four logs that you used to make your type of birdhouse in the first place and all you need is four logs of the type you're using and four clockworks. And you just use a chisel on the log and it will come up with the option of making birdhouses. And the final preparation you're going to need is to acquire some hop seed. On the screen now, I'll be showing different variants of hop seeds you could use. You need 10 of each per birdhouse that you intend to use. And for a run, you're going to need four birdhouses. So you'll need 40 bait per run. Generally speaking, there's not too much of a price difference between each of these seeds, so just use whichever one's cheapest for you at the time. And finally, we come to the method, which is fairly easy. So in the background, you'll be able to see me running through Fossil Island to each of the birdhouses. There are four of them in total. Two of them are in Verdant Valley, very close to each other. One of them is north of Mushroom Meadow, and one of them is south of Mushroom Meadow right next to where the swamp begins. And all you want to do is place or replace your birdhouses and then put some hops in them and that's it. You will then rinse and repeat like you would for a herb farm run, but you'll want this time to come back to the birdhouses to replace them about every 50 minutes. Overall, this is a really nice and easy method of getting a passive income. You only ever need to use four logs and 40 hop seeds per run. So it's really inexpensive and it also generally only takes about a minute per run as well. As to whether or not it's worth it, it really depends on you and your goals. If you're the type of person who likes to do things like herb runs, then you can incorporate this into your herb run very neatly. The other benefit of this is that it also gives you hunter experience, obviously, for each of the birdhouses you check when they've been completely filled. So it's a nice little way of getting passive hunter experience if you really don't like training hunter normally. And that's it for this guide, I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below. Anyway, I hope you had a nice day and I will see you next time. Bye guys.